Okay, hi guys. Um, I'm about to cook up dinner here, and I just had the crazy idea to try some cherry cobbler. So again, I'm going back to the Dutch oven. Again, got the coals going, and I'm kind of hoping the kids will like it. I don't know if they will, but we're going to try it. We're starting off with the Dutch oven. I got it lined with foil. I've got just some cheap cherry filling. Um, i going to get that in here. We're going to flatten it out real good. Again, I'm just testing this. I've never done it before. This Friday, though, I'm going to be in the mountains, if you will, and would like to throw together a couple of these for some guys. I want to see if it works before I get out there and make a total fool out of myself. So we'll flatten that out a little bit. No idea how well you can see this, but kind of just spreading around the cherry. Now, I have uh, saw this video on Two Brothers Adventures, so I'm just trying what they did. I haven't really looked it up or read much on this, but I'm just going to give it a shot and hope it works. Also using a yellow cake mix here. Basically, I just poured everything in here and it worked. So we're going to do the same thing and hope for the best. I was just at Walmart and bought some Dr. Pepper to go with this, which would have been really cool, but somehow it didn't make it into the car. It's still sitting there. I didn't want to drive back. It wasn't worth $1.28 to me. So, instead of Dr. Pepper, I'm going to use Coke. So, we'll pour this in here. 12 ounces of Coke. Kind of mix it around. You don't do any mixing after this at all. You just put it in the heat. So, as soon as I get all the Coke in and get my coal set up, I'm going to cook it. Supposedly, it takes about an hour. There it is. Looks kind of funky. Uh, well, I'll let you take a look here. We've got our Coke in there. We've got the yellow cake mix and the cherry pie filling underneath. That's what it looks going in. So we're going to cook it. I think it takes about an hour. I'm ready to put this in and I'm I'm gonna go really light on the coals this time. If you can see what I'm gonna put the Dutch oven on, there's 10 coals in there. So we're gonna only go with 10 coals. Last time that's all I needed and I went with more. I had that chicken boiling and I don't wanna burn what I'm baking. So let's put this in. Got 10 coals underneath. I can add more if I need to. After I do this, though, I'm going to cook dinner, so I'm hoping I can just sort of let this sit. Um, I man, it's cold out here. These coals feel good. So I've got 10 or 11 up here now. And I've got 10 underneath. So we're going to let that go. Um, it might take about an hour, so I'll come back. I'll probably check it periodically to make sure it doesn't burn. And we'll see how, how it works. Okay, this has been going about 20 minutes. And I want to take a look at it. I want to see what the progress is like. So I don't know if you can hear in there, but there's a boiling noise coming. My wife says that's okay. I actually did reduce the heat. I took off the bottom about three more coals, so we'll probably down to about seven. So it's gone about a little over 20 minutes. Um, I'm going to give it, well, we'll check it again in a few, see where we're at. Okay, this is ready, so it's time to take it off. I thought I'd give you a quick look of what it looks like in its last stage. There it is, and if you can see, it's bubbling like a little monster, but we've got cracks in there. It's starting to crack. So that's an indication that it's done. It smells delicious. There's no burning smell. And I'm actually pretty excited about it. It's pretty cool. We didn't use very many coals at all. There's just, uh, there's only like seven underneath. So as I use this chimney that I talked about in my video the other day, I could easily get enough coals going in one full chimney to do two Dutch ovens. So that's gonna be helpful to know. Uh, and like I said, we're done in here. This is looking great and my battery is about to run out. So we're going to take this off. We're going to let it cool. 
and then we'll come back to, to show you how it tastes. Right, it's time to give this a try. Still warm. <clears throat> oh man, it smells really good. I'm gonna scoop up enough for the family. Uh, Oh man, can you see that? That's looking pretty good. Um, I'm gonna give it a try. Put this back on there to keep it warm. So let's give it a shot. <laughs> Winner! Yes. The cake is cooked all the way through. You can tell there. I don't know if you can see this, but it's cooked all the way through. Um, there's nothing burnt, which is super good. And uh, yeah, overall, this tastes really good. <laughs> nice. All right. Well, we'll be back with Fight Club trying this. Heck yeah.